9.15. She wowed moviegoers in Dune Part 2, and Zendaya stars in a new movie in theaters today called Challengers. You think that tennis is about expressing yourself, doing your thing. But you don't know what tennis is. What is it? Well, the film is not just about tennis. On Skype, Kuya P of Nerds Rule the World joined us with details. Yes, John Michelle, probably the sexiest film about tennis you'll ever see. Uh, it plays like a sports film meets art house type of film. Uh, we have some young stars in Mike Face, Josh O'Connor, and the amazing Zendaya as up-and-coming tennis players. Uh, they all meet on their way up. And then a love triangle happens. One chooses uh, the other, and then they kind of separate. And then later on in life, as one is on the downfall, and the other comes back into the picture, and the challenge is on for this love. Uh, it is wild. I don't know if this is going to be for a lot of fans, but I know everyone is going to be talking about this film because of the stardom of Zendaya. She's amazing in this and she has grown in this, y'all, because I know a lot of us, you know, we've seen her grow up, but this film plays like an actual tennis match in a lot of ways. There's some slow points. I did get bored in certain instances, but then it picked up. So it was very much like a tennis match where there's slow burn in action and then the action just really goes. It's a great film. I, I have to say that, but it's a very different film. So I don't know if it'll be for everybody, but I will recommend Challengers to everyone this weekend. All right. Speaking of different, we have a voice known for funny cartoons. One of my favorite cartoon voice actors of all time doing something very different, a lot darker in Boy Kills World, also in theaters. Tell us about this one. Yes, John. I am very much an H. John Benjamin fan as well. Yes. We know him as Bob Belcher on Boz Burgers, as Archer on Archer. He's the reason I wanted to see this film. It is essentially Kick-Ass, if you remember the Kick-Ass franchise. Also, maybe Kingsman meets The Hunger Games. Uh, we have... Oh. Uh, a young boy who loses his sister in this dystopian universe um, through the, a culling, which is here we have like the Hunger Games comparisons. So he begins his revenge tour. He is deaf and mute. So hence he gets his inner voice, the H. John Benjamin voice from playing a video game. And this is where this is like a living video game movie. It is crazy. It is wild. It's gory. But if you love over the top, crazy action, if you love H. John Benjamin, like you and I do, John. Yeah. Uh, this is such a fun ride. It's not for the squeamish. There's a lot of blood. There's a lot of gore. Uh, but if you like John Wick uh, style action, you're going to get all of that in Boy Kills World. That's Kuya P of Nerds Rule the World, which previews the latest in film, TV, and streaming.